Alright guys, what's going on? Uh, back again today with another video, and I am trying a new screen recorder, a new app, so hopefully that'll work and I'll be able to give you a little bit clearer game footage. Um, but what we're going to do today is we're going to do the Musketeer Challenge. Uh, ends in 12 hours, 4 minutes, so I have plenty of time. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open up these chests first. Uh, nothing really exciting, I don't imagine, just technically just a formality. Um, nope, nothing exciting there, and we're going to hop right into it. 10 gems, why not? I'm uh, still trying to progress here, still trying to get more cards, so some Musketeers are something we're going to be able to use. So here we go. It is the draft challenge. Oh, wow, what the heck? Fine. <laughs> Only in draft challenges. Well, I'm going to take that. Mm. I'm going to take that. Oh, frig. I'll take Fire Spirits in general, I guess. Alright, here we go. This going to be interesting. Uh, it took a little bit heavier, but those are the cards I like to play with, so I mean, eh, why not? Okay, all right, that's not bad. Lightning, lightning can help my royal giant a little bit. Let's let's get aggressive here at the start. Here we go. We're gonna play that. What is he gonna drop to Candace? Oh, he drops in the other lane. Um, he's gonna do that. I'm gonna do. Whoa, I should have did fire spirits. That would have been better. That's okay. I'm gonna save my fire spirits for the musketeer. We're still gonna get some good damage. Hopefully, we'll be able to clean all this up. If not, I will take those spear goblins. Uh, I was a little bit late on that. That's okay. He's gonna drop his miner. That's gonna be annoying because that's gonna tank for the. One Spear Goblin. Dark Prince can clean it up. Again, a card that I've been using a little bit more lately is the Dark Prince, so I'm a little bit familiar with this. I do like it. It's a cool concept. Um, again, it's very underplayed. That's going to knock him back. Charge again, or at least... Alright. Okay. One more hit. Okay, cool. I can deal with that. Alright. So, a little bit behind, but not that much. Royal Giant did get a little bit of damage. This is not going to get shot off in my tower. I'm going to start a Wizard in the back. Um, and I'm going to set up for another... That's going to be great, that Goblin Barrel. My Wizard is going to clean that up. Oh, nice thing together. Thank you. Very kind. He did get a little bit of damage, but that was very clumped. And I'm going to start my Royal Giant here. Um, he's going to go in the back. Uh, I'd like to save my Lightning. Yeah, nice. My Wizard's going to do a good amount of work there. He's going to try and... He's going to log me back. That's okay, because my Wizard's getting splash damage on the Musketeer. That's nice. That's well played. Lovely. Battle Ram. <laughs> Battle Ram, just for fun. I'll play some Fire Spears just in case he drops something. Uh, in the, there we go, I thought he'd carry those with minions, that's going to be the end of that tower, there we go, excellently well played. I'm going to try and zap this with my Electro Wizard, he played a little bit deeper last time, that's why I dropped in the back. Not prefer, but that's okay. Um, so we're looking pretty good here, minute 15 left, uh, one tower down, I have this pocket. I have had a request to do a video on the pocket, which is kind of this area here, I'm not going to drop that there though, needless to say. I'm going to start a wizard in the back, haven't cycled back to my royal giant yet. Um, see what he's, what's his kill card? I haven't seen his kill card yet. I feel like it's a golem. Okay, if my wizard can get one shot, I'll drop some guards. I haven't played those yet. That's okay, we're gonna clean that up nicely. I'm gonna go over here with this. I'm gonna wait. He's gonna drop those. That's fine, really. I'm gonna do that. That's interesting. Eh. A little bit more damage. Uh, I'm gonna drop my electro wizard on these as soon as they get close to the tower. And then he's gonna help out with all this. Drop some fire spirits in the back. And bang, bang, bang. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Alright, alright. Battle Ram. Battle Ram, Dark Prince combo. He should be running a little bit low on Elixir. We're going to try and seize on this advantage here. He's going to knock all that back. That's annoying. <laughs> oh, Battle Ram should have got to the tower. Dark Prince is still going to stay alive, though. Bang. Doing a nice amount of work over there. I was surprised. That was a surprising amount of work. We're going to do this. If he takes it out, I can just lightning, so it's not that big of a deal. I'm going to drop my fire spirits. He's not going to be able to take that out. He's going to fireball. Is he going to be able to take it out? He is. All right, here we go. Extra time. All it really takes me just to drop my royal giant in the back, but he had to waste a lot of elixir to, do, to drop that fireball. So my battle ram should be able to clean this up very nicely. And there we are. One win into our challenge. Pretty well played. A little bit of a hairy start, but nice recovery at the end there. And nice and smooth so far. Nice. I like the software. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, there we go. One win. So what do we get for one win? I believe it's three. Three, five, eight. Yeah, that's how it goes. So we're going to get three Musketeers here. Um, as we're going to collect those. Great. As you can see, I'm not really using those. Maybe I will have to eventually. Uh, again, I am looking for deck ideas. Anybody has any deck ideas, feel free to let me know. Um, Musketeer. Let's not give him like a hog freeze or anything. Ooh. Uh, I'll go these. A lot of freeze over there. I'll take a meteor fireball. I took the fireball. He has arrows though. Uh, I'll take Bowler because I can counter with my Fireball. If I would have known he had those, I would have brought, I would have taken the minions. I would have taken the arrows. But oh well. That's how the draft challenge works. Ooh, poison to deal with them too. Alright, we're set for the minions. Hopefully he gave us a kill card, otherwise we're going to be in a little bit of trouble. Drop my musketeer in the back here. 
Uh-huh. He's gonna oh lava. Lava hound. That's okay, I have a nice amount of air stuff. I should be able to clean this up. It's unfortunate that I dropped my musketeer first. Um if I'd known he was playing Lava Loon, I would have probably dropped my bowler. He has a nice spear. That's not not really gonna do that. That's gonna be annoying. We're gonna drop this here. You're gonna deal with that. And I'm gonna put these over here. So turn look at the bowler. Thank you. And we're gonna be able to clean all that up fairly easily. That's pretty well handled. Ah, his freaking thing refocuses. We're gonna take this out and we're gonna try a little bit of a push. Again, I don't really Oh, that was very poorly placed. Oh well, I guess we haven't taken any damage. So lava loom. Oh no 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 no. Uh, this and then this would work great. There we go. Not bad. A little bit, a couple of shots. A little bit quicker would have been fine. That's okay. We're gonna get some chip damage. I don't have a kill card. What is my kill card supposed to be? <laughs> hmm. He has a hand. I have nothing. I all the way through my cycle. Well, all right, we'll deal with it. That's fine. This is fine. We can clean up the lava loom, and we just had to make sure we save our fireball for the. For the three musketeers, I'm gonna drop a bowler in a weird spot. Why not? Please bring your hound. I have to try and save my air shooting cards for the hound. <laughs> there it is. Okay, great. We're gonna relax. I will play my musketeer in the back here. Don't want it to get on top of the hound too early. I have my fireball ready. Uh, so he's gonna try and at the end probably pair three musketeers and and hound. I guess I am gonna start chipping this down though. That's gonna be. We're gonna poison all this. Poison, poison, poison. Soak, soak, soak. That's a waste of arrows. Love it. Now I can drop these. And we should be able to clean this up. This should be cleaned up pretty nicely. I have an alarm going off. Do, do, do. See you later. I had to get some maps or something. A little side project I'm working on. Save the fireball. Make sure we save the fireball. Okay. So again, we're sitting all right. Uh, nobody's really in the lead. I don't have a kill card. I don't know how the heck I'm supposed to win here. Supercell. What the heck? We are in double elixir. So this is where he's probably going to try and... Get me with both. <laughs> oh, was that gonna hit all? Why did I target that first? That's a little bit questionable. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not not a fan of that. We are gonna manage to take that out. That's gonna be good. I'm dropping another bowler. He's gonna come over here. With this. Uh, I'm gonna poison. Oh, it's a late poison. I regret that. But we have two bowlers on the tower. Oh no, no, no. Oh, that's okay. Actually, they're gonna walk into the poison. This is gonna be great. And we're gonna fire while that. Yes. Yas! Completely misplayed by him. Thank you. He's gonna freeze. <laughs> Alright, fine. Fine, I'm, I'm alright with that. Five seconds left. Minions! He's gonna arrow a bowler. That's not really the best. And there we go. We're gonna move to 2-0. Oh. Wow, making this look easy. Wow, that was really good. Super great play on the poison by accident. If I played a little bit earlier, I might not have gotten the extra damage to take out the musketeers, but... Whew! Now we're gonna unlock our five musketeers. This is just... I can't wait for this to completely take a bad turn and me end up losing three in a row. But that's okay. Here we are, 2 and 0, making things look like I actually know what I'm doing. Uh, that's not, never a bad thing. Okay, Musketeer Guards. I'll take Musketeer. This is a Musketeer Challenge. Ooh. Let's make a giant. Let's see if we can build around a giant deck. Poison or Lightning? I'm going to bring Poison. Oh, the double Musketeer glitch. I'm bringing two Musketeers just to show you what it looks like. Somehow that happens. I don't know why. But, as you can see right now, I do have two Musketeers in my deck. So, I'm not sure how that works. Barb Hut, which, okay, I have a not a bad job. Excuse me? I, what? Okay. Alright. Is that a joke, or, like, was that for real? Was that an accident, maybe? That must have been an accident. I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> Interesting start to the game here, for having my King Tower lightning. Uh, a little bit stunning. Stunning, a free spell. Oh, man, you give me three sp Three spells in a building? What the heck? What does he have? This could be gnarly. This could be a little bit nasty. Hopefully he has a scrammy. No. No. Get out of here. No. No! Oh god, that could have been bad. I'm gonna poison all this. Poison. Should I freeze? <laughs> I cloned in my poison. Uh, I don't need to freeze. I don't need to freeze. We'll leave that. We'll let that go. We're gonna get some good damage. Are we going to be able to take it out? Nope, but that isn't... Oh, that's important. Oh, we are going to take it out. What am I saying? What do I know? Alright, there we go. Another good start to the game here. Again, making this look fairly easy. I don't know. I'm waiting for this all to go downhill. He did lightning. I don't know what... Okay. Interesting. Mm, do I have to drop... Not really. Another reminder. I'm a very busy person. I don't know if you know this, but... Also, I forgot to check my alarm stuff before I started recording. So, my bad. This should clean up that. Um... I'm going to start another giant in the back. I don't really want to give him... If he uses lightning, fine. I'm not going to give him an excuse to play his lightning by dropping my barrel putt. 
doesn't add that much for me really. Um, so here we go. Uh, he's going to drop a dragon over there. I am going to deal with this. This is where he'll probably lightning. Oh, that's fine with me. What's he going to drop over there to deal with that stuff? I put that in a bad spot. There's a lightning spell going down. That's fine. That shouldn't do a large amount. Of, how is my king tower not helping? Again, we do have a giant on the other tower. Um, do I want to freeze? No, I'm not going to freeze. We're not going to do anything dumb yet. Don't need to overcommit. We're fine. 1400 damage under the bar put down. Um, he's going to rock it? Is that my king tower? <sighs> okay, I think he's packed it in. I'm not really sure. I can't figure it out. But then he keeps playing stuff like that, so I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'll arrow that. I'll place my giant in the middle here. We'll see if we can get two crowns. Here we go. I'm even gonna freeze. I'm gonna do this. Oh, I should have waited on the freeze. That's okay. That one barb is actually gonna do a nice amount of work if he says, Oh, look at that one barb. Go, Freddy. Oh, can I get double musketeers down? Yes, I can. <laughs> here we go. Two musketeers in the middle. We're gonna finish it off with a nice three crown. And we're gonna finish it off with a three crown. Hey, look at that. Three and oh. Um, again, that's the Valkyrie challenge. Hey, we're doing decent at these challenges. Screen recording went well. Those are just a generally good day. There we go. We're going to pick up. Thanks. Thank you, Mark Ashley. Thank you for the giant. Really love and appreciate you, buddy. It's great. So happy. Feel free to give me my CAS All Academic Canadian Award at any time. Yep. If you're watching this, this is a reminder. I don't know if you will be watching it, but all right. Here we go. Donate some cards. Free chest open. I don't have my cram chest. That's okay. And yeah, that's, that's going to be it for today. Uh, I don't really have a new deck. That's the deck I'm still playing with. I don't really have one in mind as to what I can progress with. I was kind of playing around with Giant Balloon, uh, but that's not really that unique. I like to be kind of, you know, a little bit known for my unique decks, like the Hog, Dark Prince, Lumberjack deck. I really enjoy playing that, so I'm trying to build off that and find a nice, unique deck. Uh, I don't really have that much to work with, but, eh, who knows? Maybe we'll make a Siege deck next. You know what? I think I'll try and look at this expo. I'm going to upgrade this expo, and I'm going to try and make an expo video next. So, Dirty Expo. Some people find them fun to use. It can be fun to use. They're annoying to play against. But the next thing we're going to do, we're going to do Expo. Okay? So, next video, Expo. And we'll see where we go from there. Other than that, uh, thank you very much for watching. Appreciate your time. And keep Comic Clash on, my friends. Peace.